nombre es José Manuel Pérez. My name is José Manuel Pérez, but they call me Rique. When I was eight months old, I contracted polio. So I'm 28 years old, and I have been without the use of my legs my whole life. A person uh, without a wheelchair would feel bad because they can't become integrated into society. Before I had my wheelchair, I didn't go out. I wasn't involved. I didn't have friends. I just stayed in the house. As you can see, the pathways here aren't very accessible, and the roads are very bad. It's very hard on the wheelchair. There isn't really an average time that a wheelchair lasts, but it doesn't last very long because of the poor conditions of the roads. Many disabled people don't have the opportunity to work. I am who I am thanks to my job. My family is able to have a home and food each day. I have a family of six who depend on me. I am Elder Frankham, serving in the Dominican Republic as a humanitarian missionary for the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. One of the main things that we do is to help people to help themselves. And we do that through our partner organizations. The relationship between Asoto Fimo and the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints has been a very fruitful one. It's the difference between night and day if you can obtain a good wheelchair. Over the years, the church has donated many wheelchairs to the Dominican Republic, but because of lack of sidewalks, the chairs have a very short life. The church has donated new chairs now to the Dominican Republic called the Rough Rider chairs, and they are much better suited for the terrain, for the sidewalks, for the roads, and it will definitely make a difference in the people's lives. I climbed in the chair for the first time and tried it out. I said, wow, wow, it's mine. I couldn't believe it. I feel very happy. My children need me. When they say, Daddy, uh, I need to go to the library or the park, now I'll be able to go with them because I have my chair. Before, I will always say that I can't because my old chair made it hard to go. I also want to continue my studies. My new wheelchair will allow me to do this and become integrated into school. It's a dream that I have. I want to get a degree so that my family can live better. I want to give them my very best.